Hi everyone, in this demo, we are going to show you how to configure MFA for OpenVPN. You can create your account using the following link. After creating your account in Mini Orange, log in using username and password sent to your email on account registration. Now, we will configure the AD or LDAP as an authentication source. Click on User Stores. Click on Add User Store button. Enter Display Name. Enter Identifier Name. Select Directory Type. Enter LDAP Server URL. Enter Bind Account DN. Enter Bind Account Password. Enter Search Basic. Select a search filter. Enter Custom Filter. Click on Save button. Click on Test Connection link. Fill your LDAP credentials like LDAP username and password. Get the test. LDAP connection was successful. Now, we will import the user from Active Directory and register them in Mini Orin. Click on User List. Click on Settings tab. Enable the User Auto Register option. And click on Save button. Click on User Sync Provisioning. Select your application. Enable provisioning features. Click on Import Users tab and click on Import button. Now, we will configure End User Capabilities. Click on User Capabilities tab. Now, enable various End User Capabilities as required. Click on Save button. User capabilities have been saved successfully. Now, we will create a group and assigning users to that group. Click on Groups tab. Click on Manage Groups. Click on Create Group button. Enter group name. Click on Create Group button. Click on Assign Users link. Select the users that you want to assign to the group. Select Action. The group is updated successfully. Now, we will configure the 2FA method for end user. Log in into end user dashboard or self service console using Active Directory password. Click on Configure 2FA tab. Click on OTP over SMS method. Enter your mobile number on which you want to receive the OTP. 2FA method is successfully configured for end user. Now, we will create a Radius client app for OpenVPN in Mini Orange and create login policy. Click on Apps tab. Click on Configure Apps button. Click on Radius tab and select Radius Client App. Enter client name here. Enter VPN server IP and enter shared secret key. We'll set policy for this app. Select group. Enter policy name. Select first factor type. App is configured successfully. Now, we will configure the mini orange Radius server in OpenVPN. Click on Radius tab. Select Radius Authentication Method. Enter Radius Server IP and the shared secret that we configured earlier in Mini Orange while setting up the Radius application. Click on Save Settings button. Click on Update Running Server. Click on General tab. Click on Radius option and click on Save Settings button. Click on Update Running Server. Click on User Permissions. Enter New Username. Click on Save Settings button. Click on Update Running Server. 
Now, we will test Mini Orange 2 FA setup for OpenVPN login. Now, we will connect to OpenVPN by entering the hostname of the server. Enter your AD username and password and click on connect. Enter the code and click on continue. After successful validation, you are connected. Thank you for choosing MiniOrange. For more information reach MiniOrange.com or you can also contact us at info at Zecurify.com.